Over the course of seven decades, SFE has consistently pioneered making a lasting impact in installing wide range of industries worldwide. From pulp to paper, extile to petrochemical, aluminum to power project, SFE continues to be a driving force in constructing industries. During this remarkable journey, a significant challenge emerged, an undiscovered opportunity in the vast Australian subcontinent, urging SFE to lead the way in establishing a dry stack operation of tailings from Litterite Mikkel Mine for Lucy Project. The goal was to implement an environmentally acceptable solution for managing a tailings as dry residues. The challenge accepted by SFE was to install a greenfield dewatering plant, material handling area and related infrastructure corridor, as well as KO2 plant. From installing the complete steel structure building of the dewatering plant and thereafter installation of filter presses. It also included installing the related supporting equipment of the DWP area, such as wash area, compressors, filter feed tank. The challenge extended to installation of related electrical and instrumentation systems. The material handling area consisted of a spectacular 500 meter long conveyor system with take up tower and truck loadout area, flawlessly transferring dry material slurry from the reversible feeder to two sizable bins, ultimately leading to the loading of dry slurry material onto trucks for dispatch. SFE tackled this massive task with a strong team of 300 professionals. After dedicated hard and sincere efforts by these professionals, SFE efficiently completed the Lucy project in 19 months. Notably, SFE prioritized safety, achieving an impressive 854,000 incident-free man-hours a testament to their unwavering commitment to safety during the project. For SFE's exemplary work, Crony Resources issued a completion certificate affirming safe and timely delivery of a comprehensive package of structural, mechanical, piping, electrical, and instrumentation work. Apart from contractual commitment, SFE proficiently carried out crucial shutdown tasks such as disassembling a process water pipeline all completed within the allocated budget and ahead of the planned schedule. This endeavor was monumental. SFE faced challenges in an unfamiliar continent, diverse landscapes and ventured into the mining industry, overcoming unique requirements. However, amidst the complexity, there was an unmistakable sense of satisfaction as SFE triumphed in a new arena, displaying resilience and adaptability. Today, as we conclude this chapter, the echoes of SFE's success resonate, a success built on innovation, commitment and triumph over challenges.